New Hyundai Ioniq 6 2022 – Why You Never Tesla Want to Drive – How Designed The Hyundai Ioniq 6 has the potential to be a smack in the face for the Tesla Model 3. It's possible that the Ioniq 6 will win right away. Hyundai introduced the Ioniq 5, the sub-brand of Ioniq's very first full electric sport utility vehicle. Since then, it has garnered a lot of attention for its unconventional design cues and its interior, which gives the impression of being quite contemporary. This is in contrast to other Hyundai cars, which have pretty conventional looks. In case you were unaware, the Ioniq sub-brand will, in the not-too-distant future, introduce additional cars that are positioned on a scale from 1 to 9. Now that position 5 has been filled, it's time for the 6th member to step forward and take their place in the group. Hey intellectuals and welcome back to Tech Electric. In today's video, we are going to compare the all-new Ioniq 6 with Tesla. So make sure to watch the video to the end, because this one is going to be really exciting. The Ioniq 6 is now available officially, and this video will provide you with all the technical specifications that you require. It is related to the Ioniq 5 crossover, the Genesis GV60, and the Kia EV6, all of which share the same electric global modular platform, or EGMP, as this vehicle. Nevertheless, in contrast to the Ioniq 5, the Ioniq 6 is a shorter wheelbase that measures 116.1 inches and a longer body that measures 191.1 inches. The Ioniq 6 has an overall body curvature that contributes to a lower drag coefficient of 0.21 and it also has a sleek profile. In point of fact, its drag coefficient is not too far off from that of the Mercedes-Benz EQXX, which is 0.17, but it's significantly better than its SUV sibling. EGMP Platform – The Way to Victory Because the Ioniq 5 and this new model will share the same platform, we can expect the powertrain to have many similarities to the one found in the Ioniq 5. You'll be presented with the option of selecting the rear-wheel drive model with a single motor or the all-wheel drive model with dual motors, which is the more powerful option. Hyundai, on the other hand, did not divulge any information regarding the power output of the single-motor variant. In spite of this, the Ioniq 6 will match the power output of the Ioniq 5 thanks to its dual motors, which will produce 321 horsepower and 446 pound-feet of torque. All this power will come from a standard battery pack that has a capacity of 53.1 kilowatt hours, but there will also be a long-range variant that is based on a battery pack that has a capacity of 77.3 kilowatt hours. Because it is built on the eGMP platform architecture, the Ioniq 6 can take advantage of high voltage charging system just like its SUV sibling. The 800 volt architecture enables a fast charging capacity of up to 350 kilowatts DC, which can bring the battery from 10 to 80 percent full in approximately 18 minutes. When using its supercharging technology, the Model 3 can take up to 45 minutes. Incredible electric cooktop and oven! The overall range of 256 miles offered by the Ioniq 5 all-wheel drive is not terrible, but Hyundai promises that the Ioniq 6 will have better fuel efficiency. The new electric saloon, with its aerodynamically optimized body and upgraded drivetrain, outperforms the Ioniq 5 in terms of fuel economy. The Ioniq 6 has the potential to deliver more than 380 miles thanks to its larger battery pack and rear-wheel drive configuration. When compared to the Model 3 long range, the Ioniq 6 is expected to have an increased range of approximately 70 miles. According to the WLTP, the smaller 53 kilowatt hour battery pack will have a consumption rate as low as 14 kilowatt hours per 62 miles when combined with 18 inch wheels and a rear wheel drive configuration. This information was provided by Hyundai. On the other hand, the Ioniq 5 uses 34 kilowatt hours per 100 miles, so we can estimate that the saloon will use approximately 10 kilowatt hours during the EPA test. Does the Tesla regime face immediate danger from the Ioniq 6? According to records from 2021, the Tesla Model 3 has been the all-time best-selling electric vehicle sedan, with a total of 500,000 units sold across the globe. The design of the Model 3 has not changed since it was first released in 2017, so it's still considered to be part of the first generation of the vehicle. Since we've come to our senses, we believe that the Model 3 is not the most athletic-looking electric one, and since we now have a worthy competitor, we anticipate that there will be a shift in the market share much sooner than we originally anticipated. Remember that Teslas are notoriously unreliable because the 2021 Model 3 has already been recalled 11 times. The prior iterations were subjected to even more difficult circumstances, including a total of 12 recalls for the model years 2020 and 2019. If one compares it to a brand like Hyundai, which is well known for the reliability of its products, one might conclude that the Ioniq 6 is the superior option. 
If you're prepared to take this debate to the next level, where technologies are concerned, we are going to disappoint you by telling you that the Ionic 6 already has everything. Two displays measuring 12 inches each have been affixed to the dashboard. The first is an information and entertainment display, and the second is a fully digital instrument cluster. The user interface of the Ionic 6 is straightforward, in contrast to the complicated one of the Model 3. Ionic 6, on the other hand, offers wireless support for Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, in case neither of those options is something you feel comfortable using. Another point for Hyundai's side of the argument has been presented here. The Ionic 6 sedan will feature Hyundai's most recent iteration of its SmartSense driver assistance technology, which is comparable to what Tesla offers in its autopilot feature. This indicates that all of these semi-autonomous features, driving technology such as Highway Driver Assist 2, Smart Cruise Control, and Forward Collision Avoidance Assist will be part of the newest member of the Ionic sub-brand when it's released later this year. On the other hand, 2022, the Tesla Model 3 is currently the most popular electric vehicle on the market today. If there is one EV that is dominating sales charts all over the world, it would have to be the Model 3. Because Tesla was the first company to lead the charge for electric vehicles, the company has an early advantage in all aspects of the industry, including battery technology, charging infrastructure, and popularity. Tesla has been in the news for a variety of bizarre reasons recently. The company has without a doubt received lots of attention for a variety of reasons, ranging from controversial self-driving car accidents to revolutionary engineering wizardry. Why is the Tesla Model 3 held in such high esteem by people who are passionate about electric vehicles? The price, the driving range, and the availability of charging networks are the deciding factors. The Model 3 is Tesla's most affordable vehicle and has the best range of any electric vehicle in its price range, 360 miles on the long-range version. In addition, the supercharger network owned and operated by Tesla has multiple charging stations located in virtually every city in the United States. On the other hand, it's not all laughs and games. The interior of the Model 3 is very straightforward, almost to the point of being too straightforward, which is not the most intuitive when driving. Secondly, there have been multiple safety recalls and issues with the build quality of the product. In addition to this, the overall experience and sensation are extremely uninspiring and mundane. A few parting thoughts. The electrified streamliner Ionic 6 from Hyundai Motor Company pushes the boundaries of what is possible with electric mobility, and its price is anticipated to fall somewhere in the range of $40,000 to $45,000. The world's largest automaker in South Korea has announced that production of the Ionic 6 will begin in either August or September of this year. However, the market launch date has not yet officially been announced, but we anticipate it will occur somewhere in the middle of 2023. The Ionic 5 draws a lot of attention thanks to the retro modern design cues it incorporates into its appearance. In a similar vein, Hyundai's elevated the design game with the Ionic 6, which also boasts improved electric mileage and a more extensive set of standard features. To make things right, Hyundai's devoting itself to making things difficult for people who are not enthusiasts of electric vehicles by offering models such as the stunning Ionic 6. So guys, let us know what you think about these vehicles in the comment section below, and we sincerely appreciate you for hanging out with us today. Don't forget to like and share our video, and we'll see you next time.